Hello, you're about to see my very first Zolra drop and I wanna say finally I received the drop but it wasn't that many kills, I think it was a little bit over 100. You're gonna read it in the chat once I'm gonna get it but that purple text, that beautiful purple text with combination with Tanzanite Fang on the floor, this is exactly why I PVM. You know, you may not get anything for a day, for two days but once you get that drop it just lays on the floor and that moment is just beautiful. Now, I encountered a problem. I had only 20,000 Zolra scales, which is enough to put them in the blowpipe because you need only 16,000. However, I killed 100 Zolra for 20,000 scales. Wow, so that means if I run out of charges, I need around 75 Zolra kills before I can fully recharge it again. Right now it's fine, but I don't want to use blowpipe everywhere because that's the kind of impression I had uh, before. You know, if I get a blowpipe, oh, I'm gonna go to nightmare zone, um, endurance mode, by the way, not, you know, not the one where you trade bots and you AFK. I'm not saying that the Tanzanite Fang was a bad drop. It's probably one of the best that I could have gotten. I would say Serpentine Helmet would probably have been the best as I would never get poisoned or even venomed while killing Zolra. And that would just save food. At the moment I am using Mithril Darts, I think 2.6 thousand or something. I've already added that into my blowpipe, but I just, I don't remember how I got them. I have a smithing level, so that means I smith them. I don't know where I got the mithril bars though. It was a long time ago. I, I just had them in my bank from somewhere. Okay, this has been asked in every single single player video that I upload. Show the Grand Exchange history. I don't think it changes anything because you can just trade and that's it. But I guess some people may think that I at certain point I bought something and now I just cannot show it. But here you go. There is no, rec no recorded. Heh. <laughs> Thanks, Modronen. It beats the whole purpose of this account. If you notice how I play this game, I never team anything. I hate Vorago in RuneScape 3 because it's a team boss. I hate raids because it's team bossing. I love soloing content in this game. And playing on Iron Man is like the best thing ever for me. And what if somebody finds out? Like, what if a JMod looks up and, at my account and is like, oh. Yeah, the, the guy's not the guy's not really legit, you know? No, never. Never. I don't care if some people don't believe in, in that. I, I I like to play on this account. Yeah, okay, okay. You had to drop that purple text. This is, I think, the second time I get Snapdragon Seeds ever in 135 kills. Alright, I'm gonna be a little cocky, I'm gonna try to get a fire cape without any Sara Bruce, even though I got some of them from Zolra, they should be in this tab, 50, so I think this is like one of the very few places where I actually need Sara Bruce. Well, I guess if you go to God Wars, they're pretty good as well. Yeah, so that's why I'm, I'm, I'm keeping them. So I'm gonna try to do it with just uh, Sharks, I think I need like two more player potions, because... Yeah, I want to like have a boosted range accuracy in the caves as well. So I think this is a pretty good inventory. Am I missing something? I don't know. I only have 12 prayer bonus. I would really prefer to take Archer's Helmet over this one. But I think it's going to be fine. I mean, I could take those Santa Brews, but I, I, I don't see fight caves being that hard if you have a blowpipe. So how much? What do I have? I have... Mithril darts and scales are gonna be fine. They're not gonna be finished. Also, I have like 14 damage on my recoil ring, so that's that's nice too. I think I forgot something in my inventory, didn't I? And look how fast we killed this guy. Just look at these hits. Oh my god! Like if you cannot take fire cave, try it with blowpipe. If you think you suck, you you really cannot suck with a blowpipe. It's just impossible. You almost AFK. Just if you if you're a main account, get some stamina potions. Maybe like maybe like two stamina potions. Mm, yeah, possibly. I don't want to say it because if you run out of food, then you're gonna blame me. But yeah, stamina potions would be nice. Oh man, this part is gonna suck because I don't have any run energy and Jad is stuck. Thank you very much. 
You know, every time I do Jad, I still want him to spawn in this spot because I want to lure minions so I don't have to tank them while I am killing Jad because it's kind of distracting when these guys are hitting you and you're down to like 40 health or something. You, you don't feel as safe as your health would be full. Okay, let's try one hit. Go ahead, hit me, Jad. Go ahead. Oh, okay, 68. I think I almost, like, if he actually one hit me, I think I would not have received a cape because I saw videos on YouTube who, uh, the people who died like this. I think it was from healers and they never received fire cape. And no pet. No. No pet. Should I try to gamble it? Let's gamble it. No, just joking. Never doing that again after the full inventory that I did on my main account. Yeah, this is my second fire cape on this account, but it is the only one that I have at the moment. And I don't know if I mentioned this already, but I died at Skeletal Wyverns uh, at some time in 2014, I think. And I just lost the cape because at the time the death counter was only two minutes or so. So we had two minutes to go back and I, I disconnected, so... Anyway, this is going to be the end of the video. Unfortunately, either I upload this video today or no video for four days. So I guess I'm choosing it to upload today. Uh, Invention should be coming out to RuneScape 3 pretty soon. I think it's 25th of January. So going to be playing RuneScape 3 a little bit once it comes out. And maybe uh, the new client, new RuneScape client uh, will be possibly released in beta this weekend. I don't know if it's going to be this weekend actually. They said something about NXT weekends. Uh, NXT is the, the name of the client, at least for now. So, yep, thank you very much for watching this. Let's check how many scales I've used. I had 93, and now I have 85%. So for those who cannot get Fire Cape, it's, it's too easy. It's easy mode, man. On my main account, I AFK until wave 30. Because just nothing happens and it's too boring. And when they wanted to make Jad 2, they wanted to make expansions in the caves. Once you kill the Jad, then you can continue with the caves. And I thought that was so stupid because it's not like it's hard to get to the Jad, you know. It's just tedious. It's so easy, but it's just tedious. So I'm glad. I think they, they are now making completely separate caves. So you just sacrifice a fire cape. And you will be able to do Jad 2. But I don't think it's passing. Let's check. I don't think it's passing. Last time I checked it, it was not. 72.5%. You know what? I have mi mixed feelings about this. I would love for it to pass. But I don't like the design of the caves, to be honest. I don't like it. It uh, looks weird. So, okay, bye.